Unboxing this pre cut um, box product, pre cut product. So, we're gonna see what's inside of this box here. So, let's see. Okay, all right. Okay, guys, so let's open to see what's inside of the box. So, this is the box here. See. <laughs> okay so we're gonna open it now and see what's inside it so let's do it like this i'm very curious i'm gonna stand so we can see what's inside the box okay so there's this little envelope well not really little but yes it's an envelope with a quick cut sign we're opening it up hmm. okay so we have the registration card oh this is so cute yes i like the quick cut air explorer that we got last time it came with a manual like this so now we got a manual for it and a starter guide registration card and then we have a sample for us with a quicker to put to sample it. It's an iron on EV press. And it's green, my favorite color. So, yeah, it's your favorite color. Okay. Yes. All right. So this is it, guys. Right here. Ooh. Wow. So we're going to put the box down like this and we're gonna rest on the box okay we can open it can we open it <laughs> i'm so excited so this is gonna help me to do iron on projects for anything so i guess this sack is this sack is the iron on so i guess we're supposed to iron this on to here i'm assuming but it seems so to me hmm. that's why would why would it come inside a bag that can iron on and this you know okay that's it and this is the product here it's in a bag pretty big okay you want to open it go ahead Paris <laughs> want to open it yeah. Plastic is sad. I need scissors. Oh, you need the scissors? Oh, where's the scissors? By the way. Yeah, Paris. So you need to speak loud, Paris. Okay, I'm gonna cut it right now. She's talking so soft, <laughs> and normally she's not this soft. Yes, really? go ahead. <laughs> the two side by side so you can see how they match color wise yeah i should have known <laughs> so the last thing that is inside the box is the pan that you keep it on like this voila <laughs> so pretty simple right pick up boom <laughs> so you're gonna see us like doing projects together with this. I'm gonna do a video 
with this so I think I might just do it today test it out so we'll record testing out the, the iron on with an easy press following the instructions of course <laughs> wow, this is so on here you have the power button the temperature the timer you know can the what you call to them adjusting buttons the going down or up and down button and then you turn the creaker button so we will see how it works we'll see how it works with this so i'll bring it closer so you guys can see this is it <laughs> this is what it looks like here and you can see right here you can see the power buttons right gotta adjust the lighting so you guys can see it yeah so you see that right there see how it looks it's so big and beautiful i can't wait to get started on this i'm sweating in it's hot guys excuse my sweatiness yeah and then i got the pan this is the pan so as we said we just put it on here yeah so let's see what this bad boy do yeah let's go okay guys so i'm gonna be following the instructions for the quick cut easy press quick guide so it has instruction one two three four five six seven instructions so i'm gonna be going step by step with it i already plugged it in so it's already plugged in it said um power it on so i'm gonna pull it on now it's powered on and if you guys can see see that it's powered on right um, it says set time and temperature, so set the temperature to 290 degrees Fahrenheit or 145 degrees Celsius. So we're gonna go to, oh sorry, what are we doing? Um, 290 degrees. Pressing now. I wonder if I'm a bit impatient. Ooh, I was supposed to press the temperature button so that I can move it up. I set the temperature button. Oh, yeah, it's a two. Okay, so it says set at 290 to 230 seconds. What? Okay, so I'm waiting. In the meantime, while I'm waiting for the heat up, I'm gonna put this on here. Right here. I'm doing everything on my ironing board. <laughs> so this is my ironing board. Yeah. So this is it. Okay, so it's ready. It says get prep. Find your fabric from back. The roller make sure to avoid flimsy padded ironing boards. To protect your surface, use your quick of easy press mat to hold the layer for a folded back towel. Okay, the instruction says that I must use a fluffed towel. 
so the ironing board plus towel um, ironing board won't work so this is it then it says sweet base material for five seconds I'm preheating the base material for five seconds moisture okay then once I finish that it says position the included pre-cut iron material onto the center of the bag shine dry you can not place pre-cut easy press on top of the easy press place pre-cut easy press on top that the timer and apply gentle pressure until it beats. So I am going through put it on here. But a thirty seconds. So I start the timer on 30 seconds. So as you can see, it's counting down. So that's it right here. As you can see, that's number four instruction. I'm gonna follow number five instruction now. Flip and repeat. So I must flip this over right here. Flip it over like that. And then I will rest it on here. And I'll start the timer again. So the timer is going for the same 30 seconds on that side. Okay, so let's lift it up and we're gonna flip it over now. So let's see, the next step is the big finish, right? So the big finish is this. I have to take it to a corner and peel it off like this. Are you guys seeing this? Make sure you guys are seeing me peel it off. Right, like this. See yeah, it, peel it off. Ooh, yay! Look at this guy, looking like a cricket. Okay, so this is it, right here. My Cree Cut bag for my Cree Cut Easy Press, my first design. <laughs> okay, guys. So let's take a closer look at it. Yes, then here's the Easy Press once again. Lift it up and like that. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you, guys, for watching my first video of ironing on the sample that they gave me to iron on to the bag thanks for watching bye